Hello everyone, welcome to Bike Geek, where we bring you the best tech tutorials and tips. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to control any Android device directly from your computer. Whether you prefer using a USB cable for a stable connection or Wi-Fi for wireless connection, to achieve this, we'll use an amazing free and open source tool called SCRCPY, short for screen copy. With SCRCPY, you can mirror your Android screen on your PC and control it seamlessly using your mouse and keyboard. First step is download SCRCPY. Head over your browser and type SCRCPY in search. Click GitHub link to head over to the official page to download the latest release. Don't worry. I'll include the link in the video description for easy access. Look for the release section and download the zippy file compatible with your operating system. There are different files for different operating system. We will download for Windows 64 for our operating system. Next, we need ADB drivers to enable communication between your PC and Android device. For this, download the SDK platform tools for Windows, search SDK platform tools, release notes in Google. You'll find the link in the video description below. Scroll down and download SDK for Windows. Once both files are downloaded, extract the contents of the zip files. After extraction, locate the SCRCPY folder. Copy all the files from this folder and paste them into the Platform Tools folder. If prompted to replace any files, go ahead and confirm the replacement. Now, it's time to connect your Android phone to your computer using a USB cable. When you plug in your device, make sure to select the file transfer option from the USB settings on your phone. To control your Android device from your PC, we need to enable USB debugging. Here's how. Open your Android device's settings and navigate to the About Phone section. Locate the build number. If build number is not available on your device, then locate the version and tap on version number 3 to 4 times. This will unlock the Developer Options menu. Go back to the Main Settings menu. Find Developer Option. If not available here, then go to Additional Setting, Find Developer Options here, and tap on it. Scroll down and enable USB Debugging. Once USB debugging is enabled, your phone is ready to communicate with your PC. On your PC, navigate to the Platform Tools folder. Hold down the Shift key, right-click inside the folder, and select Open PowerShell Window here. In the PowerShell Window, type the following command. I will mention these commands in description. After running this command, if you get notification in your phone to allow debugging, then allow it. If everything is set up correctly, you should see your Android device listed. This confirms that the connection is successful. Now, locate the SCRCPY application file inside the Platform Tools folder and double-click it to launch. Within seconds, your Android screen should appear on your PC. You can now interact with your Android device directly using your mouse and keyboard. Open apps, type messages, and navigate just like you would on the phone itself. If you open an app that uses a landscape orientation, the window will automatically adjust to fit the content. While USB provides a stable and low latency connection, sometimes a wireless setup is more convenient. CRCPI supports wireless control over Wi-Fi, and here's how to set it up. Ensure both your Android device and PC are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Keep the USB connection active initially to establish the wireless connection. On your Android device, navigate to the Wi-Fi settings and note down your device's IP address. Back on your PC, open the PowerShell window again and enter the following commands one by one.
replace with the IP address of your Android device. If it says failed to authenticate error, you must check your phone and allow the debugging if asked. If the connection is successful, you can now disconnect the USB cable. Finally, run the SCRCPY application again and your Android screen will wirelessly appear on your computer. And this is how you can control your Android smartphone using your computer. With SCRCPY, you can easily mirror and control your Android device, whether it's over USB or wireless Wi-Fi router. This setup is perfect for productivity tasks, demonstrations, gaming, or just a seamless Android experience on a larger screen. And that's for today's video. If you like this tutorial, then don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tech tutorials. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video.